Hi friends, welcome to my channel and this is VMware Horizon training session and this is third video in this uh, training uh, tutorial and in this video I'm going to show you the installation of uh, Horizon View connection server so we have already discussed what is connection server so this is going to give you the central administration point for your view administration which is uh, from where you can manage all your um, horizon infrastructure so let's um, <coughs> uh, find ho how you can get the horizon view product so uh, if you want to do uh, buy the product you can simply go to the uh, VMware and you can download a login by your credential and you you will get the download link for the horizon view to uh, respective um, products like standard edition enterprise edition or advanced edition so if you don't want to go with the um, purchase you can always have a uh, uh, evaluation pro product which you can try for uh, 60 days so you can see I have uh, sign up for the uh, this uh, evaluation center and I will get uh, uh, the um, um, basically 30 60 days uh, trial period to test all the products which is going to come in VMware Horizon view so this is uh, this is going to also you are going to get the user guide and product documentation like administration guide installation guide architecture and planning guide so everything you can get from here also you will get Horizon 7 upgrade guide if you have if you are running any legacy version of Horizon view how you can upgrade it so you can go to any of the these document and you can find all the products uh, by like this so like using the administration console and then you have a troubleshooting configuring Horizon connection server so you can find everything is given here um, uh, with this document also you you have like installation guide you can see this is going to give, give you the PDF file so you can also download for like you can select the which version you want to choose and then you can see all those documents so so this is how you can get the documents related to Horizon View and if I go to the uh, how to buy you can see uh, how you can buy the product you can call the VMware sales direct or you can also find the uh, partner locator and you can locate the partner to uh, get the VMware partner to sell who can sell you the basically license for Horizon View and if I go to license and download you can see we have all the products here so you have a Horizon Enterprise binary if I go here you can see the view agent 32 bit 64 bit then personalization and then you are going to have a view connection servers and so everything is there so in this video we are going to focus on view connection um, server and solution so you can see this is going to be around 26 or uh, 261 MB so I have already downloaded this here in my download folder and we are good to go and launch the setup so I'm going to right double click on it and VMware installation launcher so I'm going to launch this so this is all how you can find the VMware uh, Horizon view to download and start with it so I'm going to close this for now and this is uh, VMware Horizon 7 connection server so you can click on next then you are going to click on I accept the term and license agreement click next and then this is going to give you the installation drive or folder where you are going to install this so the default is C program file VMware VMware view and server and click on next and what you want to install so we have multiple options here so we have a standard server replica security enrollment everything is there so we are going to do the this standard server installation which is going to be a connection server 
and you have an option to specify which protocol you want to support uh, for this horizon setup so this is going to support IPv4 and IPv6 both so I'm going to uninstall on IPv4 and going to make sure this install HTML access is enabled which is going to provide your uh, end user to uh, access the um, horizon view infrastructure on web browsers so I'm going to click on next and then this is the data recovery password you must need to write somewhere to save this because if something is goes wrong with your connection server you can recover your server setting by using these settings so click next and then we have uh, some prerequisites for firewall so you need to make sure you have enabled these um, like incoming ports and outgoing ports for these specific firewall so uh, since I am in domain environment so by default my firewall is disabled for domain infrastructure so this is good if not you need to make sure you have an enable these uh, uh, pro, uh, ports so I'm going to configure firewall automatically which is going to enable uh, uh, create the rule for these incoming ports so I'm going to click on next and then which service account you want to authenticate the horizon connection view services so I'm going to use my uh, domain specific account which is I have logged in so my logged in account is basically this is the service account for my domain infrastructure so this is good view admin and I'm going to click on next here then it's going to give you the customer experience improvement program so I'm not going to join this for now so click next and then we can go ahead and click on install so this is going to install view connection server and I'm going to make my default uh, web browser Chrome here so I'm going to mark Chrome as a default browser so the installation is going to take one or two minutes to get the installation completed for connection view server so let's wait for some time now you can see adding AD LDS server role lightweight directory services which is going to be used for single sign-on features so now you can see we have a horizon 7 administration console on our desktop so this is good so it's going to take few more seconds to get the installation completed so basically in this video we require two servers here the first server is our active direct in in a server which is win 2 k 12 dc 01 which is here where my active directory and DNS role is running and the second server which we need is our VMware Horizon connection server which is win 2 k 12 cs 01 on which we are currently running the installation so if I go here you can see win 2 k 12 cs 01 which is our connection view server and uh, this is joined in my domain and ready to go so I have logged in with my domain credential with the service account and that's all and then we are good to run the setup so this is the some prerequisites which you need to make sure before going for the installation of uh, connection server so now you can see it's loading the directory services so it's going to take few more seconds here so installation completed and if you want to see the documentation you can go ahead and see the documentation always on uh, VMware website it's going to redirect you and from where you can see all the all the details of installation upgrade so if you want to view the document this is good time after post the installation you can go and review the documents if you need so this is good the installation is completed and now we have a horizon 7 administration console so I'm going to launch this console and you can see which page it's going to refer to localhost and admin page so this is going to be issue without 
certificate so let's proceed for the installation so let's require a dev flash player so run this and I'm going to manage this and allow this is going to be allowed so this is good and I'm going to run put here my details so view admin and password for view admin account and once the installation done you can go to here and you can see on the server manager you have active directory uh, lightweight directory services installed ADLDS that installed on this machine so this is good and now you can see the installation is completed and if I go to dashboard you can see the system health status and so everything is looking good post the installation of this so now we can go ahead uh, to the next task and add the license information here so if I go to product licensing use can go and enter your license so I'm going to put my license here so so this is evaluation key you can see everything is enabled so this is good and this is going to be expired on 26 November 2018 so this is all about installation of Horizon View connection server step by step so thank you for watching and please subscribe me for more videos and if you have any query any question related to this video you can always post them on my given mail IDs. thank you once again bye bye